Yes then guys, how you doing? My name's Morsi and welcome back to my channel for a brand new play review. We've got a new dynamic duo on the scene. We've got Marco Arnautovic and we've also got this centre-back, Mr. Stefan Posh. They both look really decent and super affordable. 83 overall for each of these cards. So that's super cheap, boys. Considering you get 83, so basically discard at the moment. You're not looking at anything really over 10k coins per card, which is crazy. Uh, maybe a little bit more expensive. I honestly don't know. But six for four, medium low, four star, four star is the man we're checking out today. And it is a lengthy looking beast. Marco Arnautovic. Outside the foot shot is there. That is a tick. Shooting stats look really solid. The shot power, the long shots are there. The finishing. Passing is good for the link-up play. Actual dribbling stats, decent. Agility balance, we'll see how he feels in game. And that strength, aggression, the physical side. He's going to be a brute. Six foot four as well. I didn't realize he was that tall. Four star, four star is also really nice and the pace looks good. Um, chem style, I'm pretty certain Hunter's the way to go, boys. Uh, let me quickly double check. While I'm here, I might not do a separate review on him, but let's have a little look at Stefan Posh as well. Uh, so both Austrian playing for the same team. Two star, three star center back. Looks really decent. For Serie A teams, if you want like a cheap budget option alongside uh, Tamori, for example, like this could be a very good shout. The issue for Kem like, isn't really that bad considering um, they're basically a full Kem together. All you need is one extra Serie A player or maybe even a Serie A manager uh, just to make sure that they get the free Kem. Hunter is the Kem style I'm going for. By the way, I'm losing my voice a little bit. We've been streaming a lot on Twitch this weekend. We've done our weekly. We're going into Foot Champs qualifiers here, boys. Do you want me to like if you're excited? Let's try out this man and see how good he is. All right, Nuns 11, what are we up against? Italy badge. Mike Minan, oh, he's got Syria, little Syria outlet. Very stat looking team. Foot champs qualifiers on a Sunday. Could go one or two ways. I mean, past experience is telling me that it's going to be sweaty and I'm pretty saying it will be. But big Marco on Outovic. Uh, decent, oh, decent. He's a big lad, he? Jesus. It's going to take a lot to stop this boy. All right, lads, full disclaimer, we are playing against a slow old boy here. He likes taking his time on the build-up, so uh, bear with me as we kind of ease into this game, all right? De Jong into a meal. I think we got... Is he rocking a five at the back as well? I think he is. Sweaty little rat. Erlin, unlucky. That's big. Arnautovic is in space. Little dink, he's brought the keeper out. Haaland! Let's go, man. Such a sus finish, but we don't care. And out of this, the movement was decent. He got the shot off quickly. My man rushed the keeper out, which kind of troubled me a little bit there. Uh, but we get lucky. Haaland on the rebound. Let's go. I've well done, Emil. All right, medium low work rates on an out of which could be an issue. Like in that situation when I win the ball and I want to be playing the lob through ball, he's not really making the movement. Um, he's won the header there. Just a little bit off target. But uh, yeah, medium low, always a trouble. A little bit too much power on that from Harlem, man. Should have been an easy goal. My man is fluffing his lines here. We'll take it. We will take it. Did he move the keeper out of the way there, boys? Honestly, don't know. But Natovic is on the score sheet. Once again, positioning is good. He's where I need him to be when winning these balls, making these interceptions. And uh, the composure there, little heel to heel, gets it out of his feet quickly and pokes it into the open net. 2 0 lead. Looking good. Verge. Absolute battering ram. Up to the big boy. Step overs. Oh, he's been bullied back in Pembe. Maybe with the lengthiness and the physical there, you kind of expect him to kind of be winning the ball, out-muscling the defender. But the dribbling with the stepovers alone, man, and the way he was able to turn that quick, looked decent. Emil smashed that into to Haaland. One more. Marco! And he's sprayed it wide. <laughs> Rushed the shot, but still, positioning's good. But you expect him to be hitting the target with that. I didn't put too much power on it as well. And he's absolutely splashed it wide. Emil with the press. Haaland. This is the counter attack, boys. Keep driving. Go on. Little one. Marco! <sighs> keeper. Keeper coming out is throwing me off. I took the touch. I pressed the dink. He just couldn't get the shot off in time. Are we on side there? Arnautovic? I like that little hold-up play. Having him and Haaland up front is a bit of a cheat code, by the way. Two big old boys. Drifting in is a meal. And that is goal number three. Domination in this Foot Champs qualifier game, boys. My man doesn't know what to do. Haaland, Marco Anatovic sprinted down at him. Ball, but it needs to be better from Haaland there, man. Oh, Marco. Marco is a bully. Two goals on his debut. Questionable defender from our opponent, but I'm not complaining, lads. We take the win. Let's get on to game number two. All right, can we get the two peep with the boys? You got that. Go on, posh. Poshy boy. Nice bit of play for the man. Up to Erling. Little dink. Arnautovic in behind. Love that. Love that. Arnautovic back stick. 
Pass is good. The volley. Oof. He did enough to get hold of it, lads. He's almost broke the post. Little dink. And out of it. It looks like he's teleported now. My man's on something, clearly. Um, that finish there, I just put my foot through it, boys. Like, you expect him to be in the back of the net, in all fairness. Uh, but the power on that strike, boys. If that's on target, like, no keeper is saving that. Outside the foot. Ah, big block from uh, the most overpowered centre-back in the game, Mr. Arahau Arajal. Still don't know how to say his name. I never will. Moving from an out of is a bit weird. Attack position isn't crazy. Um, but he's in the space in the pocket. There we go. Okay, a little bit of running behind there like that. The dribbling's surprising me, boys. Like, he feels really good on the ball. De Jong up to Uzi Booz. Marco again bombing forward. Little fakey there. Little scoop. Little Berber. Could he get off in time, man? Rudy goes a bully. Mate, posh. That was some phenomenal defending. And again. Let's go. The Bologna boys. Arnautovic out your feet. This is it. Hold up play is nice. The little dink. Out muscle him. Come on. It is a proper, proper match. He's up against some big centre backs here. And uh, so far, mate, they're winning the battle. Bro, Posh is done a right at the back. He's handed in Saul off quite well. Little ball roll there. We can drive. Use that lengthiness. He doesn't look super quick, but you know how it works now on new gen, boys. Lengthy is the meta, and once they get going, there's no stopping them. Decent pick out as well. The passing's nice. Um, Harlem, that's too busy break dancing in the middle of the box by the looks of it. I don't know what he's attempting there. Little give me go now. Make the movements really nice. Little floated dink. Oh, it's beautiful. Erling can't get his foot for it though. I tell you what, Arnavich is nice because he's tall, he's physical, he can hold at the ball really well, and his passing's really decent. So he's almost the ideal holding striker. If you've got a more agile lad alongside him, um, you'll be absolutely fine. Across the keeper, move him. Yes. I mean, his head. I know what's up. I tell you what, boys, it's been a cagey game. Big Mark, Marco at the back there. Come on. Now support the play, lad. We need you bombing forward with the medium low work rates. Go. He's gone. He's up there. Emil, float it. Marco, let's go. The counter attack. He wins the header from the corner. Marco and out of it. Medium low work rate is nah, mate. He's not having it. I'm not having it. He's gone. He's busted to get up there. <laughs> busted. He's bursted. I don't even know what I'm saying, lads. He got there at the end of the day and he scored the goal. Let's go. If we're on side there, I went for the floater, man. I could have dinked him in all fairness. Um, the link-up play with Haaland is really nice, though. I'm enjoying these two. So at the half, we do have the lead, and it is none other than Marco Arnautovic. We had a few chances. That last one there could have definitely taken my time. I wanted to kind of float it with the outside the foot shot. Maybe a little dink would have worked. And I'm pretty sure he smacked the post in this game as well. But we're looking good. A couple more goals. Carry this one through, and we'll be dreaming. Moving from Marco is good. That's the outside the foot shot territory. Just not enough whip on it, man. I've noticed it. He's taken about three or four of them so far. Always easy for the keeper to save. Bro, Luke de Jong is an animal. I'm pretty certain that's that power power strike time shot as well. we got a game on our hands here, boys. Count attack time. Emil up to Erling. Arnautovic has gone in space. The pass is poor, though. Oh, my days. He has pounced. The ball from Erling was a shambles. My opponent, complacent. You cannot be doing that around a lengthy boy like Arnautovic. And he beats the keeper to it. Oh, mate. About 9 out of 10 times in that situation, the keeper always gets the ball. I kid you not. That is a breath of fresh air seeing Arnautovic poke it over. Game on. Arnautovic again doing his defensive duties, lads. It's funny that Posh is the man on the counter-attack as well. Uh, the actual defender in that situation. Well done, Frankie. We can move now. Counter-attack is on. And out of it, it's a stride a little bit, lad. Use that lengthiness. Use and abuse it. Look at him go, boys. Look at the pace. I thought that might have been the angle. It felt like the animation was there. Just not enough power on the strike. But still, the pace, defending as well. The, the header from the corner. It's nice seeing your, uh, your striker do that occasionally. Let's go, boys. We needed that one. Reassurance. Hopefully that secures the W. I'd love to go 10-0 again in this Foot Champs qualifiers, boys. We went 9-1 last time because I DC'd in the first damn game. I was fuming. Uh, but we get the win. That's the most important thing. Big W from the boys. Arnautovic again on the score sheet. Could have had more. 
probably should have had more in all fairness, but still a really decent card. You've got to focus on the price. The price and the links. Like for both of these cards combined, it is cheap as chip, lads. 283 teams needed to get yourself this card and this card, which is crazy. Take in mind he's lengthy on new gen as well, both of them are. Overpowered, 6 foot 4, he's a beast. Finishing, he's got the power in the strikes. He looks like an absolute animal in front of goal. Um, did let me down occasionally, almost too much power on that volley. Passing with a linker play is really good. Dribbling, those little snippets where he felt really quick. Really responsive on the ball, but the agility and balance may, you may notice it, especially when you're trying to get going quickly. Uh, like if he gets stuck under his feet a little bit, it may struggle. Outside the foot shots were a bit poor, in all fairness. I score a lot more with other cards, but still with the trait there, if you get at the right angle and the right time, you should be fine. Posh, really solid center half. I like him. A nice cheap beast as well, alongside some other options in that league, like your Bremers, for example. Him and uh, Bremer, probably a decent little duo there. Can also play it right back this card as well which is nice. I didn't look at all the positions, only striker and center forward here. Medium low work rates as well, may let you down. Occasionally, I didn't, well, I almost wanted him to overlap with Haaland, given goes. He wasn't about it. He was staying stagnant, which is a bit of an issue. But if you're linking at the player with Albi passes, you should be fine. But overall, it is a W for me, boys. Cheapest chips, nice little dynamic duo. Every one of them so far has been good and affordable. Do let me know your thoughts down below. I'll be more to subscribe if you're new. I'll catch you very soon.